Hi band and welcome back! In this video, we are going to answer a very frequently asked question, which is how to get a pick out of a guitar. And today with me here is Otto. Can you tell us a little bit about what happened? The same thing that happens to me basically every day. For some reason, I decided to play my nylon string guitar with a pick and in it went. And of course, I have no idea how to get it out. I think I've tried everything. But I have an expert here who is gonna guide me through this. Ready? I'm so ready. And I'm <laughs> a little bit scared. <laughs> Tip one. Shake it. Shake it, yeah. That one I've actually tried. And even this is supposed to be the best way to do it. But... <laughs> Let's try something else. Tip two. Try to reach it. This one I haven't tried. So I thought that this wouldn't work. <laughs> you feel it? Like with your fingertips. I think my hand's stuck. I touched something and it was sticky and slimy, but I don't think it was there. <laughs> I don't think it was the pick. <laughs> okay, well, let's try something else then. <laughs> tip three. Have to get a stick and some tape. Okay, so this is what I got. I got a drumstick and tape. I have such faith in this, uh, this method. Okay, now they I should... just have to locate the pick inside the guitar. And... Why aren't they like selling these in music stores? Because this is like, there's a business idea for you. Yeah. The sticky stick for the picks. Did you like read this from somewhere? No, it works I, for me. I can't believe like James Hetfield, <laughs> but he never drops his pick into his guitar. The stick is in the guitar. <laughs> <laughs> Let's move on. Tip four, just tape the sound hole. You know, put, you know, a lot of tape, you know, on the sound on hole. On the sound hole. You know, some arts and crafts. That's enough. Yeah, and I just have to, you know, flip the guitar so the pick gets stuck on okay. tape. This is even worse than the first one. I'm telling you. It's like, it's like the first one, but with like obstacles. Something else then for a change. Tip five, vacuum it out. Now that makes sense. Right? So, we have a vacuum cleaner, wire. I just stick it in and vacuum it out. I smell victory. Or dust. Imagine doing this on stage in the middle of the gig, your pick gets stuck, and say to the audience, Excuse me, I have to get my pick out. I think the method is great, but the vacuum cleaner just doesn't cut it. It's too old. Yeah, but I think you should go with this first. My favorite so far. Number six punch it out. I don't want to harm my precious guitar, so I'll get a punching glove, of course. <laughs> is, is that what you call it? How much faith do you have in this? You know, you have to hit it in the right place. So I have to know where the pick is. Like, you have to the know bottom. where it is. And you have to give it a good punch so that it kind of like... Flies out. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, I heard a crack. The guitar is not supposed to fly. The pick is supposed to fly inside it. See? It's moving. I don't know what's wrong with this method. I think. Do you think it's the glove? Love is not, oh, wait, sorry. <laughs> And we're just uh, not too good at aiming. I think it's just like was. I haven't been boxing for a while. So I think I'm rusty. But a good method all, the, all together. Bye bye. Okay. How about we pump it out? Yes. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just try <laughs> to get like this. You mean like air pressure, just like yeah. the vacuuming, but reverse. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah, exactly. Okay. You know, it's physics. <laughs> I was thinking like the pick is heavier than air, so obviously. It flies. <laughs> Do you think we the guitar might explode? Are you something hard enough? I wonder if we misunderstood something with the whole physics part. To be honest, I wasn't a strong believer. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> you neither. Pump? That's that's a no-go, okay. It's like one out of five just, stars for this yeah, purpose. Yeah, just forget about it. Okay. Tip number eight at this point. I think you should just, you know, give up. Use another pick. Okay. Do you have one? No, I have many picks. <clears throat> but uh, yeah, I guess it doesn't affect the sound that much if it's there. Like, <laughs> like no, 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 I guess many guitarists have like a lot of picks inside their guitar, and they just yeah, like never. Totally. Okay. Yeah. So I'll show you how it. Uh, how... Oh, you've got to be kidding! <laughs> so this is embarrassing. Okay, uh, I I'm not gonna put another pick inside there. Okay, let's okay. try one more thing. Number nine. You have to cut the strings. Let's come to this. Mm, you just, you just have to. You have to make sacrifices. Here we go. Just don't. Don't like hurt yourself anymore. Okay. Bye bye. Oy. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. Watch. Watch your eyes. It's, you don't want to get those in your eyes. 
He might have actually wanted to loosen the strings first, now that I think <laughs> of it. I'm a man of danger, so there should be two, so I would expect to find at least one. Oh, oh no! I can't, like, I haven't touched it once, and I've been doing this for like five minutes now. I think this has been debunked. You cannot remove a pick by taking all the strings out. We're kind of at the end of the line. What can well, we at do? this point, the only thing you can do anymore is just to make the sound hole bigger. Yeah. Make it bigger. And that will save us time in the future. Exactly. Right. You need a hammer. It's my favorite guitar. Trust me. You're an expert. I'm an expert. Be careful first. Okay. Ooh. Yeah. That's... I can see it. Ah. There it is! Right there! Ta-da! <laughs> we got it! That was easy! Right? Yeah! There we go! No more picks in the guitar! Okay folks, that was it for today! Now you know how to get a pick out of a guitar! Hopefully you won't have to resort to the last method. I think that was the winner! Oh. See you in the next video! <laughs>